Dude, when you did, um, what was it? The last stock when you did a uh, down throw, and then he tacked and he jabbed and dashed up air. Uh huh. Was that supposed to be a fair or was it supposed to be a fair? Um, <laughs> honestly, I wanted to Waveland charge up smash. Yeah. But then I just, like, messed up. I don't know. And then I accidentally jabbed, and I was like, oh, I guess I should. Yeah. It would have been nuts, though. Because I think the upper might have killed, honestly. But yeah. I don't know. It was definitely not intentional. It would have been really sick. I've never done anything intentional my whole life, except for uh, up B peaches. Oh, this mouse is so slow. Honestly, they're both they're both cuties, let's be real. Yeah. Scythe and Quinn, the cutie, the cutie <laughs> match. The cutie clash, clash of the cuties. Oh, that's too close to cutie clash. Way too close. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, yeah. Quinn, uh, currently 15 on our PR, but the PR is kind of outdated. He'll definitely be higher. Yeah. He's uh, one of our, he's a resident ice climbers, basically. Um, one, I think our most recent Arcadian, IIRC. Um, basically, he's good. Watch out for him grabbing you <laughs> and you dying, basically. <laughs> uh, but yeah, he's very new, so that's okay. I wish I could. What are you trying to do? Uh, the chat's just like. Uh, Quinn definitely has his Arcadian Arcadian rhythm down. Um, but it's up to Scythe Magus to prevent him from getting the grab in the first place. That was not. Yeah, no, that shot is pretty <laughs> questionable, but it's okay. Falco, like, destroys. Sopo. Like, it's not even funny. I think Falco destroys Ice Climbers yeah. as a whole, too. Sopo's but... worst matchup is Falco, right? Sure. I don't know. Sopo <laughs> should lose to everyone, so yeah, it doesn't no, matter. Yeah, no one does. Yeah. Yeah, platform cancel there? I see. <laughs> oh my god. Just... That was the nuttiest thing. I've actually ever seen in my entire life. Oh my god. Wait. Did you guys just see what happened? He just like, he down through and then he just like forward smash Popo and then, oh my god. Oh nice, he died off the platform. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow, okay. Good thing he held away there. Wow. The Scythe is flying around. Oh, they're next to each other. Yeah. Whoa. Takes him to FD, so it goes Falcon. Um, it's best of five, so there are no bands. Uh, kind of interesting. I updated the score, by the way. Yeah, it's, you just click two buttons. Um, interesting. I think Scythe kind of plays Falcon, but I wouldn't say it's necessarily as good as his Falco, but maybe he just feels really comfortable in the matchup. Oh. Oh my god! That was crazy! That looked kind of BM, but I don't think it was BM. I think he just messed up and then capitalized off of his own mistake. That's... That's the 15... That's the number 15 in Chicago right there, dude. You make a mistake, but you capitalize off of it anyway. Do you guys see? Oh. But yeah, basically Falcon can just, like... He has really strong, safe aerials on shields, like me and Stomp. Oh, Quinn went ham, dude. <laughs> I kind of like that about Quinn. He he's like confident that he can because if you have both ices, like you can make it back from that. He just I guess miscalculated how long Nana was in tumble or like in space properly. I don't know. But yeah, basically, Falcon, you just like stomp at me, and as long as you do it late enough, which he didn't, but as long as you do it late enough, they can't really hit you. Also, side B is surprisingly good. Uh, normally, Falcon Raptor boost like grounded is like kind of dangerous, but um, Icy's slide far enough away when they get hit that it kind of works out. Anyway, he gets wibbly wobbled. Oh! Oh my... That's terrifying. 
Yeah, I should probably be dead now, but it's fine. Oh, he goes after Sopo. Interesting. Wow. That was sick. Wow, I, I'm a fan of what just happened. Oh, he just gets grabbed at zero. That's nutty. Also, getting floated is sick. I've only been floated like once in my whole life, but it's nice. But I also like pools, so. Nice. Wibbly wobble. That's kind of what happens sometimes, but honestly, Falcon can just kill Nana in like two knees, so it doesn't really matter. Draft crews are happening, but um, TMG is like, oh, how did he miss that tech? Wow. Okay. Get Wobble. Wow. SSB stock, you are correct. Quinn is on. Oh. oh. That's kind of weird. I feel like Quinn's dropping more than I've seen him drop, but I guess it doesn't really matter. That's one mm -hmm. So we got 1-1. One, one. The only problem with losing with a character you switched off of is that, like, now when he goes back to Falco, his tech skill is not going to be as crisp as it could be. Um, but that's okay. You could argue you don't actually need tech skill. You just... Oh, wow. That was actually... That was really cool. Um, Quinn shot an ice block, and uh, Scythe just got under it. Oh, my God. That was freaking terrifying. <laughs> I would have just mashed shield grab in that case if I was going, honestly. One thing I'd like to see Scythe do more is shine up B Nana off the top. Like, if instead of that second back air, he just shine up B, I'd feel like Nana would have died. But I guess it doesn't matter. Um, I actually suggest for everyone watching, uh, looking up CPU versus Army. Um, CPU is an Irvine Falco who's actually really good at killing Nana. Like, Nana should be dead right now. Like, if you just shine up B. But. I think he's kind of opting to do damage to both at the same time, which is a viable strategy, but honestly, like, Nana could have been dead there. Like, if you just shine up B, Sopo literally can't, like, you, she just can't reach you. That's right. You start taking doubles. Oh, not yet. Oh. Yeah, you should start doing Yeah, Scythe is doing a pretty good job making sure he's aerialing. Nice. He's waiting, um, either until... Quinn is already doing an action, or he's just aerialing past them, so he can't get shield grab. Um, once you do that, honestly, the matchup gets a lot more nicer, but it's a friend. Depending on character. Nice. So, oh, nice. Rolls behind him. They can't, it's really hard to get the wave dash back in time. Um, and since, since they were already shielding, they had to wave dash back, so. Ooh, wow. There's a lot of like really solid defensive options. Like he intentionally ASDI down the, the jab there and got pushed off the platform so he didn't get grabbed. Ooh, okay. He kind of messes up his fastball there. Wow, okay. I was not expecting that to hit, but I think the incline of Yoshi's helped him out a bit there. Nice. Honestly, I'm like really impressed. I feel like Sight normally does this Sight normally lose this, you know? Do you, do you know what their set record is? I don't. I think Quinn last won last time they played. Okay. Yeah. I mean, Scythe is ranked higher for sure, but for sure, right? Yeah, for sure. So currently. Should we see it on yeah. Uh, I don't know. I have no opinion. Okay. The difference between two and three doesn't matter because they play each other anyway. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Either. But like normally you would see. But holy shibboli, dude! That was nutty. Also, do you mind? I can't read the whole chat. I don't know if I'm supposed to like be looking at it, but... I just noticed my name, so I was like, oh. Yeah, that's in inaccurate. Connor definitely carried me really hard in Arc Ellis teams. And in TMG every year. But anyway. So, Fountain... Um, oh, that was so sick. It kind of makes sense. Um... The other option you could kind of do is uh, Icy's generally like that was a miss. That's rough. That was a miss input. I think he was trying to mash, uh, but he wasn't grabbed yet, so he just mashed buttons and got up B randomly. If he was Fox, that might have been fine because there's fire. But nope. 
Um, but yeah, Fountain kind of makes sense. Uh, the other option is generally Pokemon because it's it's very flat and long, just like a uh, FD is. Oh my God, Psych, you're crazy, man. Whoa, you're crazy. Okay. Honestly, like, I think if Scythe just got slightly better at killing mana, it'd be fine. Like, most of the time he's opting to kill Sopo. Um, I already mentioned this before, but, like, that's fine, but... Like, Falco can just kill mana. Like, mana could, could die right here. Oh. Obviously, it's scary, but, like... That's just part of the match, I think. Uh, one thing also uh, I've noticed when I'm playing Quinn is that he's pretty solid at reading my uh, platform movement. Um, like, Sheik Icy's a lot of it is just like sort of camping platforms and like running around. Um, and so a couple games that works, and then all of a sudden he starts reading out of my movement patterns. Movement patterns. So I have to change up what I'm doing. So right there, uh, a couple seconds ago, we saw Quinn like read Scythe jump to a platform. So. Uh, let's see. That's rough. I think you can just forward smash that. Oh, he read the double jump. Nice. Is yeah, he like right here? I think if he just shine up beat Nana like twice in a row. Like the shine up beat won't kill Nana if necessarily, but she's stuck in the air, right? So she's she's just gonna fall straight down, and then you just shine up beat her again. Is basically what I'm, what I'm saying. But, that being said, Game 5, thank you all for joining us at twitch.tv slash MeleeEveryDay, streaming Speakeasy Smash, Tuesday, weekly local in the Chicagoland area. Alright, he goes to Dreamland. Um, this kind of makes sense, um, in the sense that the side platforms are higher, so it's harder for... Um, Ices to contest the side platforms with their aerials. Um, like, I don't, like, you can't short hop up air these platforms, but you can on, uh, oh, jeez, oh, on other stages, for example. Um, yeah, that's a pretty tough situation. I think if he smashed the eyes of Blizzard really hard, then he might have been able to get out, but otherwise, yeah. Um, yeah, game one was Battlefield. It was Battlefield, Scythe 1, FD, Quinn 1, uh, Yoshi, Scythe 1, Fountain, Quinn 1, so. Uh, oh, that is unfortunate. But it's okay, because I believe. Yes, you like right? Well. Honestly, even though he's down like a full stock, it literally just... I feel like it kind of just doesn't matter. Like, Falco should just be able to kill them right now. It's a solid opening, but he kind of messes up, but like... Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh my <laughs> god, I can't believe that happened. Uh, oh! <gasps> oh. Scythe. Scythe is a dog. Wow, Scythe is flying right now. Oh, okay. He definitely read that, but misspaced it slightly. I've heard that be called a uh, reading in the dark. Ooh, you definitely do not want to DI in there. If you DI in on down throw, it actually true combos into down smash. Um, you have to DI away and hope and force them to tech chase you. Um, I leave Sunday, January 8th. That's my flight. Contact shine. Yeah, like if you just shine up being Anna here, so Sopo literally can't get you. Like, it won't kill, but... Oh, actually, it might kill now because she's pretty high. Uh, yeah, he's not he's not buffering rolls out of getting jabbed either. He like CC the jab and shielded, but you gotta CC a uh, roll away. It's like really important for Sices. Uh, I will be at wit. Wow, he's lucky he did not land on the platform. Oh my god. Oof. 
That was crazy. Got grabbed from like behind. But looks like it's over. Unless Wispy can mess up with some stuff, but it's basically dead, yeah. Um Quinn. Is that what we want or do we want a loser smash? Yeah, probably not. Okay.